Hey, 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 everybody. What's going on? Welcome to my channel, T-Girl Magic Tarot. Yeah, yeah. Here to do a reading for my G -G Gemini. My Geminis. What's going on, Gemini? High vibe, cross watcher. Everyone is, is welcome. Thank you, thank you, and more thank you. Thank you for all your support, your love, your donations, your emails of confirmation and everything gemini thank you high vibe cross watcher sending you all the love light and healing energies to everyone now um it's a general message is not going to resonate with each and every gemini high vibe cross watcher or nobody only take the energy that fits with you and leave the rest and don't force nothing okay it's not always about you um so yeah Let's get right into it. Choir, come on. One, two, three. Oh, T-Girl, Tarot, Magic and Collective. T-Girl, 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 Magic and Collective. T-Girl, Tarot, Magic and Collective. Come check us out and see what we're about. Mm. We are Gemini, 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 Gemini. Gemini, we sing Gemini, 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 we are Gemini, 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 Yay! Okay, let's get right into it. Ancestors, Holy Spirit, Ascended Masters. What energy? Number one, they want you to know you're protected, okay? Regardless, that's number one. The inner, I get a protected energy. You're always protected at all times. You have a hedge of angelic protection around you from the Father, the Most High, Yahweh, from your ancestors, from the angels. Um, And it says the fairies of protection are shielding you with a magical fairy ring and of love and light. Um, Practice psychic protection before embarking up on any spiritual work. So I'm getting that you're always protected. Just know that you are always protected. But um, when, just just take note that, you know, always be, you know, up, up the antes because there is an energy trying to um, look. There's an energy that's a darker energy that they believe in magic too. So maybe they don't, I don't know what the hell is, um, believe in magic. Open your eyes and see the magic is all around you in nature. The fairy of the northern lights say you're a part of nature, so you're magical too. So you are magical too, okay? I'm, I don't know. There's something going on in the ethers right now I'm picking up, okay, that I'm feeling. There is somebody that is casting negative projections of energy towards you. Look how this person is looking right now. You see how he or she is looking? Mm-hmm. It says they want you to experience every moment fully. So somebody's trying to go back in time trying to change something in time okay because we have precious time the fairy of time wants you to experience every moment fully to be able to make the most of your precious time be mindful not to waste others time either okay somebody wants you to come back they're doing something in the ethers you're protected whatever they're doing your angels got it okay they're popping that shit back whatever that may be but somebody wants you to yeah they want you to forgive them, okay? They want you to forget something. They want you to go back in time and, I guess, forget whatever actions that were taken. That's what I'm getting, okay? So you're possibly dealing with a warlock or a witch, okay? Um, And they want your healing. Somebody's desperate for your healing, okay? You have this, you're an earth angel. Look at you. This is how this person sees you. Look at the difference between the two of these energies. Now, I'm picking up sisters as well. It could be a cousin, a feminine energy I'm picking up heavily. Or if it's a male, he is in his feminine energy, okay? This warlock feminine energy. And, um, and you're the light angel right here, okay? You're bringing balance or the angels are bringing balance to the situation. So no, there's no need to worry, you guys. Okay, God has showed up, okay? This is the life force, the life energy, the energy of all of us, okay? And so now it's right by protection. So God is literally protecting you. Like I said, Yahweh, God, Ra, whoever you resonate with the highest resonate resonance of the highest um, frequency of God, the up one, <laughs> that's the one. So it doesn't matter in a sense, like we know who we're talking about. Because everybody wants to argue about, you know, God and this and that. Look, it's we all know who who the, the highest the highest light 
white light is, the energy source, the one how we all got here that created, and it's for the upright, okay? There's a duality. There's light, and then there's dark, okay? So God the light, and then there's God the dark. So, I mean, this person's on the, the God of the dark, him downstairs, and then we have the God of light. So it's a battle of... It's a battle of good and evil. So you're in a war right now. So whoever your person is that you're thinking about, this was your nemesis to make you into this life energy, if that's making sense, okay? To elevate you into this life energy. Healing. The happy fairy of sunshine been, brings a lot of life-giving energy and she remains, uh, oh, she reminds you to shine your light and to reveal anything that the shadows need to be healed, and see, so whatever you're doing, you're going within right now and you're clearing out um, blockages, what is, you know, hurt, pain, things from your past. You're moving through that and you're transmuting that energy and, you're, and it's giving you life. Okay, so whatever energies that this dark energy, whoever they are, are projecting towards you, it's just shielding and bouncing off of you. Just know that the higher your vibrations are raised... No dark energy. Now, I'm saying this is not everybody, okay? Only if those who have done the work and they have a specific... I am talking to a specific light worker or whoever you are, earth angel, you have a specific calling, okay? Many are called, but few are chosen and you have been chosen for the calling of this mission, okay? And so you're in a spiritual war with whoever this energy is, okay? You spent a lot of time with this person. You did, you went through a lot of struggles with this person and you helped heal this person and you tried to bring the, yeah, your intentions with this person were pure. And it is a friend. It is a friend from your past, a dark, evil ass witch. Okay. She was jealous of your wisdom. She was jealous of, jealous of, or he or she was jealous of your celebrations. When you would walk into a room, people would cling to you. People would love you. Look how beautiful you look. You would you would change the atmosphere of the room and it would become a celebration. I'm kicking up. You are the life of the party. And this person, whoever this sister or feminine, masculine energy is, they were jealous that the, you called the room's attention because they were used to being the center of attention. And that's what I'm getting. What else, Holy Spirit? Mm -hmm. So you removed yourself from this person. You purified your energy. You're too pure to even be around this energy. Look at this. This is your friend. Your friend is dark as hell. Okay, whoever this energy is, they're an evil ass MF at the end of the day. But don't worry, you're protected. You see the darkness, okay, the light angels, the rainbow, the spectrum, the, the light. You are protected. You are covered in light around from being protected from this dark energy, okay? Because you are the life energy. God in you is the life energy. That is your protection. That is your protection and your knowledge. Knowledge is power, okay? By you knowing who you are and standing in your truth and your power, that is elevating your energy. And that's making it of the highest vibrational frequency in order to gain this protection from the most high. So it's, you're doing the work. Whoever you are, you're doing the work. Well, you have no choice but to do the work. You're an earth angel. You're an earth angel. That's what you do. Okay? What else, Holy Spirit? Yeah, you purified your energy like I said. A lot of you are magical little unicorns. Okay? Melon-filled babies. And you don't have to be melon-filled. I'm just teasing, you know. But trust in the purity of your heart. Look inside your heart. See, everything you do is with pure intentions. And this person, whatever they did in this magic shit is evil ass intentions. This is your friend now, just let you know. They've been doing divination on you. Okay, but spirit stepped in to find some type of balance. Look at you. This is the energy you're in always. And this is why balance is being restored because you're not petty. Okay, you're not low vibrational. You're not hateful. You're not evil. You're full of love and light and happiness and joy. You balance out. You transmute that energy. You take that dark ass, nasty ass, evil ass energy and you transmute it into light. Okay, the life, the life energy. This is what you transform that into and you purify. Every time you purify and that's important too, okay? Remind your, well, keep in mind of how you're feeling at all times, okay? To, to send back any projection of negative energies back to the sender in love and light always, okay? That's what your intentions are. Your intentions are pure and never to hurt anyone. So the energy that's being projected towards you, Oh, this person's starting not to believe in their magic no more. Their magic ain't working. Spirit had that flip upside down. Yeah, because look at you. You wise and whatever you do, you know how to cast that shit back. You see, 
You see how she got her hand up? You see how the Holy Spirit just comes straight down like that? Okay, giving you wisdom on how to counteract the certain energies that you're feeling. Okay, look. Yes, nature signs. You pay attention to the signs and synchronicities of nature, the things around you. Definitely. It says be receptive to the subtle natures of messages. I mean, the subtle messages from nature as you go about your day. And nature talks to us continuously. We need to only open up our hearts and our minds. That's all we need to do. So what's now lost was lost is found. Okay, now this person trying to find something. I don't know what's going on. You have a familiar that's protecting you though, for real, for real. Definitely. Um, you have new beginnings coming into abundance and this is what this person was trying to stop. They were trying to sneak into your dream state and I don't know what the hell they was trying to do, but they was trying to take what your abundance. They were trying to take your abundance in your dream state. So that's why, you know, no, because they knew something like I've been saying in the last readings, wait for winter. Okay, something's coming in winter and somebody's trying to, so I'm getting also as well, whoever this energy is, sister, a friend, I heard brother for some of y'all, okay, a brother in a feminine, in, inside his feminine energy, okay, jealous of you because you're the light one and you're protected and your intentions are pure, Um, but I'm picking up love too. Somebody's going to come and tempt you in love. I don't know, motivation. Mm, and to, to the point where you're going to want to be motivated to hear them. So, Spirit, why would, why, what's going on? Tell, tell us the deeper issues of this whole situation. Why are we squirting and skedadding around it? Because someone's going through judgment, okay? Whoever's coming towards you in love or whoever, way, however, they want, an apo they want to apologize because they're entrapped. They're under judgment. They're facing some type of judgment, okay? And what else, Spirit? What's, what else? Why is this person doing magic? What else is going on? Mm, yeah, the magic backfire. This person's depressed. Okay, the whole damn deck flipped in reverse. Oh, did it? No, it didn't. Look, they're depressed and they want to come make this offer towards you. I don't like this offer right now. Their intentions are not good. They're going to come trying to say their intentions are pure and they've wised up and they've changed their ways and they've healed but they haven't healed. So they're going to come to you asking you for some type of forgiveness or some forgiveness. They want to start all over and make a solid offer. But Gemini, you're going to leave them out in the cold. You're done with this energy. Yeah, you completed the cycle. Yeah, you did, baby. Look at you, Empress. Look at you. You ain't no fool because the fool came right up under after that. Yeah, you think it's a... Yeah, you don't want to take a leap of faith. You don't want to take a leap of faith with this person. And what else, spirit? And this person's going to get imbalanced when you walk away from this person. Oh, my God, spirit. What's going on? What's the imbalancement? Because I feel like, how is this person going to feel when Gemini rejects them? Gemini, they're going to feel like you did it in oh an, an injustice. Even though it would look like it wanted to flip in reverse. Look, I'm going to take it in reverse because the next card that I see is the temperance in reverse. So they're going to feel very imbalanced and they're going to feel lost like the lost and found, like they tried to, they tried, they were lost and they come seeking you. I'm picking up also, you guys have some, um, animals that are, um, a spirit's telling me monitoring spirits. Okay. So this person's trying to do something. I kept pecking up the ether, something in behind somebody sending animals to you to track you, to look for you. I don't know what the hell's going on, but anyway, they're going to, they're imbalanced and they feel it's an injustice because they are fucking, they don't have no, they don't have no money. Okay. And they're going to turn toxic. Oh, he might. Oh, you know what? Y'all stay away from this energy though, because I don't, I don't care who it is, who this energy is. They're extremely toxic and abusive. They may start to cause a fight when they feel like they're, they're, they're not getting their way because you want to move to calmer waters by yourself. Or they want to move to calmer waters with you and you're not taking their offer no more. Okay. The temperance. This is the temperance angel bringing balance. There's no balance here. The temperance. They come to you for forgiveness. And because of you have abundance. Spirit saying protect your abundance. This person's coming in and it's coming in. So I mean look. Something about winter and purifying your energy. So that's what you're doing right now. A lot of you have done that. And whatever you're doing right now that shit's working. Um, keep, uh, yeah, protect your dreams because there's abundance here and this person's going to come in when you reject them and they're going to start some type of fight, chaos, cuss you out. Um, yeah, they're going to speak some, yes, they're going to call you a hoe. 
Yeah, they're going to say you're delusional. They're going to come drinking, though, too. They're going to be, like, maybe drunk or popping pills when they say that shit. Yeah, they're going to speak some fucked up communication to you, possibly bringing things up from your past, how you used to party, shoulda, woulda, coulda. And then after they do all of that, then they're going to be heavily burdened trying to apologize to you. This person might have a mental problem. I'm picking that up because they're cussing you out over here, all mad and, and, and irate over here because you're not taking this baby ass offer because you're in the Empress energy, male or female. Okay, you're moving away to calmer waters away from this flighty ass energy because you see them being like delusional and in their shadow side. They're going to communicate some bullshit to you. And then they're going to be going into regret, heavily burning with the Ten of Wands. <laughs> and then saying, I'm sorry that I, can we start all over, please, Queen of, Sw Queen of Swords, Queen of Wands. And you're like, bitch, after you backstabbed and betrayed me, hell no, we can't. You're moving forward and you leaving this motherfucker stuck and you moving to forward. You're moving on to victory and success, Spirit. Say that's the truth and to your happiness. Oh, Lord have mercy, Gemini. So that's what's going... Uh, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, Spirit, what is this person going through literally like what this current moment moment? How are they even making it to Gemini? That's what we want to know. And this ain't for everybody. So if they don't know where you live, this ain't for you. I don't know. I mean, we don't know what the fuck they're doing. How are they trying to come towards Gemini or High Vibe? Gemini, they're coming towards you. What? <laughs> what does that say? With the tennis. So they're coming in to backstab and betray you. What are they coming in? How are they coming towards Jimmy? Jimmy, Emmy, Emmy. Gemini, they're going to come to you all full of Queen of Cups and love and everything. Like they want to work on this with you. It did flip in the reverse. But they don't want to work on it with you though. What was their intentions though, Spirit? So this was this person's intentions. Your money, your abundance. So that's why I'm picking up heavily. What's, why is this cold thing keep flipping? I ain't never seen. What the hell is this? I'm sorry, y'all. I don't know why this whole deck is flipping and it had a mind of its own. I didn't, Spirit, wait. <laughs> wait a minute, Holy Spirit. I can't. This is a lot. Why is they get yeah, well, money, money, trying to come to calmer waters, rushing in towards you? The cost and top of illusion. They still in their shadow side, huh? We have the emperor reverse, the king of cups in reverse. They want to get out of being stagnated and stuck and shit from whatever magic that they done did with somebody else or a high priestess, king of swords in reverse. Oh my God. Wait a minute, spirit. Hold on, y'all. Mm, 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 mm. Y'all, I'm so sorry. Apologies. Uh, I, I apologize. Because I did not try. Honey, this death was not like this when we started. What is going on? Okay. Okay. I'm gonna, uh, hold on, y'all. It's almost done. <laughs> y'all so patient. I love you so much. Oh, babies. Okay. Spirit, how are they? Yeah, they're coming to travel towards you. Ooh, wait a minute. Spirit, they coming to, what the hell is going on? How they coming to travel towards Gemini? I, I, I don't even know. How they coming? Because we got the five of pentacles. They homeless. We know that. Okay, how are they coming to travel towards my babies? With an apology and an equal give and take. And they coming to move. Well, how, do they have a core? I don't know. How do they know where Gemini at? For these, Well, some of them, they do know where you're at. Gemini, well, unbeknownst to you, they've been creeping and spying and lurking and looking because looking, I did see the Page of Swords. So I don't know if they're going online looking for you or if they have, I don't know, Gemini. I don't know, baby. Look, they looking, they trying to figure out where, where you at though. I know that. And some of them do know where you at. They got, I don't know what, how do they know where Gemini is, spirit, for some of them? Mm, wait a minute. Int, what? What does that mean, high priestess? Because high priestess don't tell shit. Or maybe they... Mm, I don't know what that means. They drove by your house with that horn honk or something, spirit, or astral project, scrying, whatever. Why are they in the Nine of Swords? What is this, y'all? Mm -hmm. well, how do they know where Gemini is, spirit? How do they know where Gemini is? I don't know what that is, y'all, Okay. The nine of wands in reverse. Yeah, somebody's trying to travel towards you to get out of this heavy ass burden. Definitely. They walked away from you. So they're trying to walk back to you and give you some type of apology because you're single, abundant, the empress, in, empress energy. They come in to travel towards you. Definitely. What does that spirit want me to look at this? King of Cups. Mm, but they don't have no strength and courage right now. They're all emotional. They're in their emotions. They're being cold and detached. 
They're bored where they're at. They're angry. They're still toxic. They're lashing out on everybody that, around them. Oh, my God. Yes, they are, child. And I don't know what the hell had happened. Spirit, what's going on? So they not doing good, I guess. So what? I don't know. Spirit, tell, just talk to me. Because I don't even know what to ask. Yeah, they want a new beginning, honey. And some of them want to get you knocked up and pregnant. And they want to reconcile real bad and come out of the cold. But you call, you're going to leave them out in the cold. And you're moving forward. And you close out a cycle, Empress. Yes, you did. You shut all this shit down. And you raised your right hand and said, fuck that shit, Hierophant. You could be dealing with a Taurus. And then the tower came down like, hell no. Nah. Now they all crying over spilt milk. Imbalanced and emotionally imbalanced. Child over you, Gemini. The Queen of Swords energy. Yeah, the Queen of Pentacles energy, Empress. And all they're doing is talking shit and gossiping and spying on you. Yes. Watching you get this Ten of Pentacles and celebrate. And they watching you go into a new other Two of Cups energy. Or they will be going into your Nine of Cups wish fulfillment, will of fortune, and celebrations, bitches. Wow. Okay, anything else, Spirit? What is this person hiding from Gemini? That's what we want to know. What is this person hiding from Gemini? They got They still marry. They possibly still marry. To somebody, a queen of pentacles. What else? Yeah, they married. They married. They married. Yep. And they're going to message you. What? And they still got another woman on the side. Yep. After they message you, they want a new beginning. And they got a queen. They got a baby mama over here. Y'all, they ain't going to tell you that shit. Yeah, they got smoking guns and smoking mirrors and causing illusions and stuff like that. They don't have no strength, no courage, no self, no self, no discipline, no nothing. Spirits say that's the truth. Yeah. And they do shit impulsive for money at the end of the day. This person's depressed. They're sad. What is the Hermit in Reverse Spirit? What is that? The Queen of Wands. I guess the Queen of Wands is making them sad. I guess whoever they got with is making them sad. <laughs> or maybe it's you, Gemini. You, the Queen of Wands energy. You're the life force, the life energy. You're abundant. And that's why they're depressed because you're the life force and you're abundant. Wait, can y'all see that? Okay. And y'all are abundant over here and they're in the hangman mode they don't have they they stuck right now look while you're moving forward in victory and success you could be on a platform you could have your own um you could be a healer a psychic whatever you do yeah and whatever you're speaking child is making this person feel stuck I, okay so maybe you're speaking some type of truth yeah y'all about to go into this marriage Definitely, that's your in or, 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 or if it's not a marriage, it's because the four of ones means contracts, it could be a new job, a new project, or whatever. But you do have new beginnings because this is gifted from God, and this is a payout right here. So, y'all about to get a payout and just wait for winter. Winter's coming around the corner, or it's already here. How I'm feeling, and it's being cold. There's a lot of abundance because you have purified your energy. Okay, so that's literally what's going on around you. The angels are working really hard, you know, to keep your energy pure. You got to do the work too. So you're doing a good job. Angels are doing what they got to do. Keep moving forward. So the energies that you feel, always be aware of what you're feeling so you can pop that energy back to as you have been doing in the ethers, in love and light, okay? This dark ass energy, inner, energy sister, ex-lover, whoever is trying to attack you. Jim and I'm an injury reading right there. I hope this has helped. I love you so much and stay safe and I'll talk to y'all soon. I love you. Bye.